Hello again, second graders. Today, we are going to take a look again at the consonant, vowel, consonant, syllable pattern. So to start out, I want you to listen as I say a word and clap once for each syllable. Listen, helmet. I counted two claps. That means there are two syllables in the word helmet. Let's try it together. Listen to the next word, tablet, tablet. How many syllables are in the word tablet? Tablet, two syllables. Let's try a few more words. Witness, I counted two claps, so there are two syllables in the word witness. Sudden, sudden, sudden. Again, I counted two claps in the word sudden. That means there are two syllables in the word sudden. How about the word conduct? You try it, conduct. How many claps did you have? Two? Good job, there are two syllables in the word conduct. So, I want us to take a moment and remember that words are made up of parts called syllables and that each syllable has one vowel sound. On your screen, you will see that there are two lists of syllables. I have some syllables here on this side, and then again on the other side, I have more syllables listed. We are going to make two syllable words by combining a syllable from this side with a syllable on this side. I will give you clues to help you form the words. Let's take a look here. So, the first clue I have is, this is a baby cat. This is a baby cat. So we would have kit and ten. Kitten, okay, and when we write that out, kitten, we have two syllables, count them, kitten. Very good. Let's take a look. My next clue is a spider makes this. So let's see, here we have the syllable cob, and we're gonna match that with the syllable web, and that's what a spider makes, a cob web. Excellent. You can hear each syllable very clear there. Cob web. Let's do another one. This is something that's good to eat. What do you think this would be? If you said muffin, that is correct. And again, you hear the two separate syllables. Muffin. Excellent. What about this? A person who fixes your teeth. If you guessed a dentist, that would be correct. Again, you hear the two syllables, dentist. Excellent. And our last one to match up, my clue is that this is a container for holding things. And if you said basket, that's correct, basket. Now, let me see, when we write these words here, girls and boys, let's take a look what they look like. You have kitten, K-I-T-T-E-N. Notice that we have our two vowels, I and E. And between those two vowels, we have two consonants, and that's where we would divide kitten into syllables. Let's take a look at another word that we just made, cobweb. All right, again, we have, we always find our two vowels, our O and our E, and when we have two consonants between them, between the vowels, that's where we're gonna divide our word into syllables, just like we have cob, web. Another word we worked with today was muffin. Where do you think we would divide muffin into syllables? Excellent, between those two Fs. All right. Thank you. Have